Well, hello everybody. RV living with the geezer. And uh, I haven't been back here in a long time. This is the back part of the uh, raised right ranch. You can see there's the house up there. and There's Blanca. I don't want to bring her back here. And there's, there's Hank and old uh, troublemaker uh, Dixie. She's got something she's chewing on there. No telling what. But, uh, yeah, uh, I'm afraid if I brought Blanca back here, she, uh, she might, if we ran into a snake or something, she'd probably go up and try to kiss it. So, uh, she kisses everything. So I'll just, I'll just leave her up, up there for this little short, short walk. Yeah, this is two acres back here, and his front part that's fenced off where his house is is one. So I think he's got right at it, even uh, three acres. This is a neighbor's uh, stock trailer. I think they've got some cattle over here on their place. My son used to have livestock. That's what he thought he was going to do. And uh, found out that it was quite a bit of uh, problems keeping them in. He had a guy come in and build a fence. And uh, when he first bought the place, there was an old fence, and the guy came in. All he did was string some wire over and put up some of these T-posts, strung wire over the existing old posts, and some of them were rotten. And Yeah, it wasn't a very good uh, fence job. But, uh, yeah, he hung a deer feeder right over here, and we've been getting nine, ten deer in the mornings and the evenings when the feeder goes off. We've been getting them coming in, eating that corn up. Old Blanca back there, see her at the fence? Yeah, she said, why didn't he take me? This isn't going to be very long. But, uh, but here's the main place where they would get out. He's got a creek running through back here. It's dry most of the time, but I tell you what, heavy rains... Look at this gully on this thing. I just ate a ham sandwich, so pardon me if I burp. Look at this. See, and the guy didn't, he didn't put in, he didn't put in, uh, he just strung a real lightweight cable across there. You have to put in a heavy duty water gap on creeks and what it does when the water comes up they usually have like cedar posts or whatever on the bottom of them and it floats up and lets the water pass through and then swings right back down well that guy didn't know what he was doing so every time and i've seen this creek flood quite a few times but every time it would flood it would wash the the water, his fence out, and then the donkey. We had, uh, at one time, he had three donkeys, three goats, and a Shetland pony back here. That had, you know, and they would get out, and what a pain that is. You know, but you can see where that, the force of this water is tremendous, you know. And then, uh, let's see if I can get down here and, without falling on my butt. Oh, there's Dick. Dixie got through the fence somehow. Come on, Dixie. Come on. I'm going to have to get her back, back up to the house. I tell you what, Dixie, you are something else, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, you're something else. You just, uh, <laughs> yeah. Every time I turn around, I'm doing something to correct your, she stole my uh, insulation that I had left over my foam insulation to wrap the last little bit on my trailer where uh, where I fixed that leak. Um, I know she took it and I cannot find it. So I, I'm gonna have to buy another, another piece of insulation. That uh, stuff that looks like a, uh, you know, that you like swimming pool noodle or whatever they call them. Dixie, come on, come on. Come on, let's go. 
can't believe she actually came. So. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to show you this back area here. Show you that creek. We actually fenced, we put a cross fence in right here where the animals were just in this one area, but they grazed it down so quick that uh, he was feeding them, uh, having to feed them hay. And uh, boy, that can get real expensive real quick. So, all right guys, it's me and old Dixie are gonna go back to the house. And there's Blanca up there waiting saying why Dixie get to come and I didn't she's and there's Hank laying at the gate so I'll get old Dixie back in the yard over here all right guys before she runs off on me peace out stay blessed stay positive I'm just out walking around talk to y'all later adios bye bye